Most theories suggest that our galaxy is 13.81 billion years old, and the Sun, the host star in this galaxy, is approximately 4.6 billion years old. According to some studies and conspiracies, one day this 4.6 billion year old Sun will swallow Earth. Now, if this is true, when exactly would it happen? Will our planet Earth survive if it is swallowed by the Sun? Why will the Sun, which is the host star of our galaxy, swallow the Earth? In today's video, we will uncover just these facts. So make sure to stick till the end to find out exactly when these things will happen. Our Sun is a star, and like all the stars in our universe, it has a limited lifespan. As mentioned earlier, the Sun is almost 4.6 billion years old and some reports show that it is in the middle of its lifespan. Now if that's the case, will the Sun explode one day or will it degrade in some other way? Well, the answer is that our Sun will not explode like any other star out there. You see, the Sun can't explode because it is not a massive star that follows the specific conditions leading to supernova explosions. The Sun is classified as a G-type main sequence star or G-dwarf star and it is in a stable phase of its life cycle known as the main sequence. The process that prevents the Sun from exploding is related to its size and mass. The Sun is not massive enough to undergo the same explosive fate as massive stars that end their lives in supernova. Supernovae occur in massive stars that have exhausted their nuclear fuel and experience a sudden gravitational collapse, leading to a powerful explosion. Now, if that's the case, then the mighty host star in our solar system will have some other way of degradation, right? Over the next 5 billion years, the Sun will embark on a fascinating journey of transformation, transitioning from its current state as a stable G-type main sequence star to the grandeur of a red giant and ultimately culminating in the creation of a white dwarf. The Sun's evolution is a testament to the dynamic nature of celestial bodies. Currently residing in the main sequence phase, the Sun is a stable source of energy, fueled by the ongoing nuclear fusion of hydrogen in its core. As this hydrogen is gradually depleted, the Sun's core will contract under the relentless pull of gravity, setting the stage for a celestial metamorphosis. The red giant phase marks a pivotal chapter in the Sun's story. Over the course of millions of years, the outer layers of the Sun will expand, potentially reaching the orbit of Earth. This expansion is driven by the increased gravitational pressure resulting from the contracting core. While Earth won't be engulfed in the traditional sense, the expanding Sun will cause the outer layers of our planet to be stripped away, rendering it an inhospitable and desolate world. As the red giant phase unfolds, the Sun will unleash powerful solar winds, also called streams of charged particles that carry away a substantial portion of its mass into space. This solar wind not only contributes to the erosion of Earth's atmosphere, but also sets the stage for the creation of intricate structures in space known as planetary nebula. These nebulae are the remnants of the Sun's outer layers, forming visually stunning displays that enrich the interstellar medium with elements forged in the heart of the dying star. The eventual formation of a planetary nebula signifies the Sun's transition from a vibrant, energy-producing entity to a remnant of its former self. What remains is the core is a hot and dense mass, primarily composed of helium and heavier elements. This core will contract further, evolving into a white dwarf. Unlike the Sun's previous phases, the white dwarf will no longer undergo nuclear fusion reactions, and its energy output will be a mere echo of its former brilliance. As the Sun transforms into a white dwarf, Earth will orbit this remnant, now a barren and lifeless world. The absence of an atmosphere, stripped away during the red giant phase, will leave Earth a desolate rock. The white dwarf will persist for an extremely long period, gradually cooling and fading into cosmic obscurity. This expansion will also likely lead to the engulfment of the inner planets, including Mercury and Venus. The outer layers of the Sun will extend outward, reaching or even surpassing the orbits of these inner planets. After losing mass through solar winds, the increased luminosity and size of the Sun will influence the orbits of Mercury and Venus. While the exact details depend on the Sun's evolving characteristics, it's anticipated that both planets will experience significant interactions with the expanding solar envelope. Mercury, being the closest planet to the Sun, is particularly vulnerable to this process. 
The intense heat and gravitational effects will likely cause its surface to be scorched, and it may eventually be enveloped by the outer layers of the expanding Sun. Similarly, Venus, the second planet from the Sun, will face the expanding solar atmosphere. The combination of increased heat and gravitational interactions may lead to the engulfment of Venus, or, at the very least, a substantial alteration of its atmosphere and surface conditions. As we've explored the mesmerizing cosmic tale of our Sun's evolution, from its stable main sequence phase to the impending red giant spectacle, we're confronted with the inevitable fate that awaits Earth. In about 5 billion years, as the Sun expands into a red giant, Earth will bear witness to a transformation unlike any other. The once vibrant and life-sustaining planet will succumb to the solar onslaught, with its atmosphere stripped away and its surface rendered barren. While the thought of Earth's demise may evoke a sense of awe and melancholy, it also serves as a poignant reminder of the impermanence woven into the fabric of the cosmos. Our journey on this pale blue dot is but a fleeting chapter in the grand cosmic narrative, urging us to marvel at the intricate dance of stars and planets and to ponder the profound mysteries that lie beyond our celestial abode. As we contemplate the destiny of Earth and the Sun, we are humbled by the vastness of space and time, inviting us to embrace the wonders of our cosmic home and cherish the precious moments we have under the Sun. That was it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to drop a like and subscribe to our channel. If you want to see more videos like this one, drop a comment down below. Thanks a lot for watching this video.